Hello friends, welcome to science for you. Today, I will show you how to make a cyclone arcade game using Arduino. This is a classic game in which the bulbs light up in a circular fashion like a cyclone. All the LED bulbs will be of one color and just one bulb will be of another color. I have chosen one bulb in red color and all other bulbs in yellow color. The objective of the game is to press the switch immediately as the red bulb glows. If you get the timing right, all the bulbs will glow fast in a circle, five times confirming that you have won the game. If the timing is not correct and you have pressed the button when the yellow bulb glows, then all the bulbs will glow on and off together five times, indicating that you have lost the game. If you like my videos, please subscribe to this channel so that you can watch interesting videos in future. Thank you. For this project I have taken 10 numbers of yellow LED bulbs and one number of red LED bulb. First, I 3D printed a frame for this project. Now, insert all the bulbs in the holes of the 3D printed frame, as shown. Next bend all the negative terminals of the LED bulbs inwards. The shorter terminal of the LED bulbs are the negative terminals. Glue all the bulbs in place using a glue gun. Also take a push button switch with 4 pins and glue it as shown. Next, take an Arduino Uno board and 11 number of male to female jumper wires. Connect the jumper wires to the digital output pins of Arduino from pin number 1 to pin number 11. Next, connect the other end of the jumper wires to the positive terminal of the LED bulbs. The jumper wire connecting pin number 1 is to be connected to the positive terminal of yellow bulb, just left of the push button switch. The jumper wire connecting pin number 2 is to be connected to the positive terminal of the next yellow bulb in the clockwise direction and so on. Likewise connect all the positive terminals of all the 11 liters ED bulbs up to pin number 11. Now, take a copper wire and remove insulation as shown. Bend the wire in a circle and solder all the negative terminals from the LED bulb to the copper wire. Connect the other end of the copper wire to the ground pin of Arduino.
Now, take a jumper wire and solder to the top right pin of the push button. Take another jumper wire and solder to the bottom left pin of the push button. Take a 1 kilo ohm resistor and solder to the top left pin of the push button. Solder the other end of resistor to the copper wire, already connected to ground and negative terminals of all LED bulbs. Connect the other end of the jumper wire connecting the top right pin of push button to plus 5 volt pin of Arduino. Connect the other end of the jumper wire connecting the bottom left pin of push button to pin number 12 of Arduino. This serves as a trigger from the switch for detecting the pressing of the switch. If you make any mistake in these connections, it will not work properly and hence do these connections carefully. Take a battery pack and connect the positive battery terminal to V and pin of Arduino and negative battery terminal to ground pin of Arduino. I also made a 3D printed base for the frame. Join together the base and the frame. Now the last step is to connect the Arduino to PC or laptop using USB cable and upload a code. The project is complete. Now let us test the working of the project. After switching on the battery, you can see the lights glowing in a circular manner. The objective of the game is to press the switch immediately as the red bulb glows. If you get the timing right, all the bulbs will glow fast in a circle, five times confirming that you have won the game. If the timing is not correct and you have pressed the button when the yellow bulb glows, then all the bulbs will glow on and off together five times, indicating that you have lost the game. If you like my videos, please subscribe to this channel so that you can watch interesting videos in future. Thank you.